Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the Serious Sweet C Presents the British Christmas Collection. And I have the, just the British assortment. These were $6.79 each at a world market. And I picked them up because they're British and they're different. Each yeah, they're box different has different things in it. So first, we're going to concentrate on this one. This is the British Christmas Collection. It has butter fudge, mince pie fudge, mm -hmm. and black forest fudge. So this is all fudge. I'm going to open it. It just has a little plastic tab. Okay, so this is the butter fudge. And then mince pie. So we'll keep them... Keep them in order here, and then black forest. Doing across the top of the seam or across the side? <laughs> um, these are made in Harrogate, England. Suitable for vegetarians, it says. A selection of fudges compromising butter fudge, mince pie flavor fudge with raisins, mixed peel and spices, and dark chocolate fudge with cherries. So the butter fudge is just a plain, it's the plainest in here. And it is uh, 140 calories for 30 grams. So you would have to weigh it out. What are mm. Mm. That's a good fudge. Mm -hmm. Very sweet. You know, we bought some fudge when we were over there. That is excellent. Um, excellent. Do you remember buying that fudge when we were over there? Um, it's for rim. Oh, it wasn't the last time we were there. Was no, the no, it was the time before. before. We were mm -hmm. on that bus tour somewhere. Mm -hmm. And they had fudge that tasted just like this. This, um, that is um, better than any fudge that I can get around here. And that's, I mean, that might bother. It has like a burnt butter kind of flavor. And it, but it's so it's over good. the top sweet. It's very sweet. absolutely incredible. You like that one. Um, I would like to buy a whole box of that. And this one is the mince pie flavor with raisins, mixed peel, and spices. The mixed peel is what I got a little piece of. And that's what I like. Mm -hmm. That reminds you of a fruitcake. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm, that's really good. I love the raisins in there. And the spices are really, really good. That's incredible too. Mm -hmm. That's a good combination. That one... It does make you think of Christmas though. Oh yeah. That the spices. It's also excellent. It's over the top sweet. It is. I mean, like on a scale of one to ten, this is like a fifteen. <laughs> That's how sweet it is. It's very sweet. But you do get a lot of the spice. Um, you do get the raisin. Um, the raisin is the best part. I wouldn't have thought I would have liked raisin with fudge. With fudge, it's, it's delicious. Really good. Yes. This last one is dark chocolate fudge with cherries. Let me tell you this too. Sorry, the butter fudge and the men's pie were both 140 calories for 30 grams. This one's 130 calories. This is the lowest one. It's good. It's not sweet, but it is very good. Ooh, you get that cherry flavor. I didn't at first. That one, I love it. It tastes it's like a chocolate covered cherry without that juice. Mm -hmm. yeah, um, I can see that. It has a different, it has a texture of a traditional fudge, more like what you would have here. Mm -hmm. It's a firmer fudge yeah. than the other ones. The other ones are kind of crumbly. Crumbly, yes. Um, which I think that is is absolutely, all of these. All um, those are good, but honestly the men's pie one, I could eat a whole box of. That's oh, my really? favorite. Out of that box, that's my favorite one. Because um, I love the flavor of the spices mm -hmm. and the uh, and the raisins in there. Mm -hmm. I didn't get a lot of the peel in mine because I didn't get that bitterness. I didn't get but, a lot of peel. But I got a little piece by itself, and it was. It was you typical. don't get much. I do have to say that you. This is something that uh, yeah, you don't get a lot of. But um, it. All of these are such good quality that you mm -hmm. might wonder: Is it worth the price? This the, it is really worth six dollars, six seventy nine. More expensive, but they are very, very good. It's very. Yeah, my favorite was just the butter fudge. Really? Now that was good. But I like them all. Yeah. I really do like them all. Okay, so now this is the British assortment. And did okay. you open it? Okay. It has salted caramel fudge, 
peanut brittle fins and milk chocolate honeycomb. Which is all traditional like British candy. Yeah. So you can tell those are the honeycomb and the brittle. Let's try the first thing. Yeah, salted caramel. Yeah, I'm curious how different the salted caramel is going to be from just the butter. Um, and these are all different calories. Yeah. Uh, the salted caramel fudge that we're going to try first, it's all based oh, wow. on 30 grams. So it is 120 calories, which is 20 fewer calories than just the regular butter. There's a smaller piece too. You want a bigger piece or? It smells really good. Mm. I love that. I do too. Wow. It's almost like you've stuck brown sugar in your mouth and it just melts. Yes. And it's like pile of grainy sugar. Oh, it's so good. It is incredible. This is now the, that is over the top sweet for me. It oh it is. Mm -hmm. The name of the company is the Serious Sweet Company. Well, they they did so, seriously a job. <laughs> you can buy containers of this fudge over there. You yeah. Know yeah, and some of these companies only make things to ship over here. I know, which is weird. and it's like I, it's like you're reviewing. Somebody said to me the other day, "You're reviewing a British product, but I've never seen it here." And then somebody else told me, um, I think it was Frankie. She told me she said I saw that in like a a garden shop, a lawn and garden shop, which in Britain it sounds weird, but she did. She might not in a garden center. Maybe that's what she called it. In, in Britain, yes. So it's more of a specialty thing. So it's not going to be common like at Tesco or someplace. Right. It's going to be more of a specialty shop where it's probably more expensive too. So this, this the oh wow, that's my that's yeah, my that's piece. your piece. <laughs> <laughs> we know uh, the brittle toffee. It has peanuts and uh, peanuts. Uh, it is 160 calories. The texture is the same texture as our peanut brittle, but the flavor. They're all stuck in your teeth. I love the sweetness of it, and yes, it will get stuck in your teeth. Mm -hmm. uh, peanut brittle is one of those things. Unfortunately, if you have trouble with your teeth. You wouldn't be able to enjoy peanut brittle at all. Very crunchy. Um, and maybe not these either. Um, but that, that is delicious peanut brittle. Mm -hmm. It has um, all kinds of peanuts in it. And it's good. It's very good the, Yeah, the, like the syrup itself is very sweet. I know we've said that about all this, but it is so, like, some things that we get from the United Kingdom, it's like they're not as sweet as what you're used to here. These, if you buy these in America at World Market, you're going to be pleased because it is what you're, it, this is even sweeter than what you're used yeah, to here. Yeah, it's very sweet. The last one is the milk chocolate honeycomb. So if you've ever had a crunchy bar, that's what this should be yeah. like. Honeycomb is like a fluffed up sugar. Right, this is a chocolate covered honeycomb toffee. It's 140 calories. I think I'll give you a couple smaller pieces if you want. You I'm going to bite these in half so you can show it. Mm-hmm. That's good. It's not the best honeycomb I've had, but it's good. Mm -hmm. It's not quite as airy mm -hmm. as some of the other ones we've right. had. Right. It's delicious. It's very, very good. I don't know if I like it as much as a crunchy bar, mm -hmm. but it's still terrific. Mm -hmm. The now, crunchy just has more air holes in it, so it's like, like picture something that's fluffed up this much, and then the other ones are fluffed up that right. much. You know, it's really, really grown. But that still is good. It's out still of, excellent flavor. Um, out of this collection, the salted caramel fudge is. <laughs> oh yeah, probably mine too. And um, then the peanut brittle. I love these. I think these are so good. I think these would be an excellent gift. They would be a terrific gift. Uh, they really. If you got a five dollar gift, I know this is going a little over five dollars, but nobody ever spends five dollars on a five dollar gift. Yeah. Um, I think these would be nice to take to a party as like a five dollar exchange gift or, or yes, something like that. Yes, because you're getting for adults especially. You're getting three individual things in each box, yeah. and so it's not like it's all the same thing. So maybe if you don't like one kind, we'll give it to your friend or yeah. give it to somebody else, and you can enjoy the ones you do yeah, like. I agree. 
there's not any of these that I don't like though. Mm -hmm. I think they're all delicious. Yeah. And there's nothing you're going to be going, eh, I'm going to leave that alone in the drawer. The only bad thing is you're going to want to eat the whole bag because you don't <laughs> get, yeah. you don't get that many and you're going to want to eat that whole bag at mm -hmm. one time. That's the only downfall. Uh, so they did a terrific job. It's very, very good. Very good. So, um, if you can get them in the United Kingdom, let me know. Uh, they're probably, I wouldn't think they would be in the same box because the British, just, so I wouldn't think they would put that on their boxes. Their boxes okay. probably just say uh, the Serious Sweet Company. So you'll have to let me know if you can get them there. So I will have a picture of this plate for you at the end. And thanks for watching.